Hi, I'm Jale. Welcome to my channel. This is going to be a general collective reading for the sign of Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and or Venus signs for the 1st to the 15th of December 2020. Let's take a look, figure out the theme for Aquarius, please. What is the theme for Aquarius between now and the 15th? What is the theme for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus? We've got the High Priest in reverse. Possible Taurus energy here. Could be someone not learning a lesson. Could be an end of a commitment. Bottom of the deck world. So there's a possible lesson that hasn't been completed or a commitment that's ended. Let's have a look. Maybe a journey or something being learned, not learned. Let's take a look. Aquarius, please, Spirit. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. Cross Watch, first the 15th, please, Aquarius. Cupid's arrow. Have faith. Love is coming. Surprise invitation or meeting. Hesitation. Watching, looking, stalking, gaslighting, perception, focusing out. Let's take a look. Aquarius, please. Some moon rising Venus signs. So we've got some things that have maybe changed or, or shifted from people's first impressions maybe into closure because we've got Anima Mundi. So something's shifting here. Um, something is no longer valid. Something is no longer received or wanted. Right, let's take a look. Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Sun. Aquarius, up to the 15th of December, what's the theme? reputation and this is air energy so someone's maybe worried about their reputation so they're not learning a lesson and they're putting their reputation before anything else possibly bottom of the deck is compromise which is a fire moon um, let's have a look let's see spirit for aquarius please sun moon being assigned and including the 15th of December 2020. What is the theme for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs, Cross Watcher, up to and including the 15th of December 2020? What is the theme, please, for Aquarius? Protection, extremism, and wow, intense revenge. Um, we've got Scorpio energy here, Aries energy, and we've got loss, bottom of the deck, Pisces energy. Someone could be trying to protect you from a situation, maybe, because of an extreme situation, so they're worried about how that's going to affect you. Maybe they've protected you and sort of walked away from something. Um, maybe they couldn't offer commitment because of a, another situation that hadn't quite ended, and so they're trying to keep things a little bit under wraps because they're worried about reputation. Um, again, maybe they're trying to protect themselves. They could be protecting you. Let's take a look. It's going to be different for everyone. Right, let's see. For Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs up to and including the 15th. 15th of December. What is the theme, please? So we've got Imagination. Um, I embrace and nourish the creative aspect of my mind and success. I know there's no greater goal than love. And then let's pull while I'm headbutting my candle light thing. And I've just realised I haven't turned my lights on. Sorry about that. <laughs> Not that it really matters, but let's see. We've got January, something happening or resolved in January. We've got Camel, persevere and you will overcome problems. July, 
man dealing <laughs> dealings or relationship with a man apple temptation will test you and broken bridge unsuccessful outcome to a problem egg success assured with good plans and hard work let's take a look with the secret tarot let's have a look see what's going on here so spirit for aquarius sun moon rising venus signs up to and including the 15th <clears throat> Can you give us more information, please? Right, so there's some kind of secret emotion someone's hiding. Um, there's also something secretive that there, again, it's a successful outcome is what I'm hearing. Um, there's some kind of secret plans that they're, they're not telling anyone. It could be to do with work. Um, let's have a look. Let's clarify with another spirit. What is... Oh, Aquarius is uh -oh. cards flying everywhere as usual. One second, guys. One sec. We've got cards going absolutely everywhere here. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I should have just paused the video. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. <laughs> oh, what a wally. Right, come on then. Let's go. Let's go then. Right. I'm hearing secret success. Here's the moon and the man success. He's not in a position, this person's not in a position to go towards his emotions. He's not in a position to go towards his emotions. So he's probably choosing some kind of other option over his real feelings. Um, again, could have Leo in his chart because we've got July. So there could be someone with a strong Leo element here. Um, he could also be in another commitment, which is why he can't come forward. But could be someone worried about how it's going to be perceived or what people will think. We've also got a situation here with possibly a karmic partner where they're possibly trying to move away from that situation. Um, or maybe they're not learning a situation with a karmic and they're, they're in a cycle and they haven't acknowledged it. They're still trying to put energy into a, a karmic situation which is also not going to lead to a successful outcome because I think they're walking up the wrong path, basically. They're confused. They're, they've got illusions here. There's too many illusions and it's leading them into, I mean, they're worried more about their reputation. They're, they're worried more about their reputation here. Let me move this card so we know we can determine which is which. All right, let's have a look. There's something about possibly a lease that started in July. If, if your person's lease or some kind of movement around July, if they've got a year's contract, there's something about that that they, they feel they're tied into some kind of lease. Could be a house lease. It could be something related to security. But it's like that's another reason why they're like, well, I have to do this because I live with this person and there's a lease. But there's something around that is that I don't know. It feels like they're using that as a kind of excuse here. But... It just feels like that's the part of what they've been working through with their process, their thought process. Someone is trying to control some kind of work project and they feel like getting involved emotionally in a situation is going to keep them. It's going to cause a, lot, a lack of control. And so they're also trying to remove themselves from anyone that could bring. A disruption to them because they're, they're focused on, on, on their work or some kind of financial situation um 
that there's definitely some kind of unsuccessful outcome around this here based on these decisions they're making and it's based on ego and they're trying not to acknowledge their feelings they don't want to acknowledge their feelings there could also be a third party here as well again could have been, met someone in july could this person could be a leo that they are trying to balance the situation out with um they are also in their ego and they feel like to acknowledge the feelings for you is there's too much work involved so they're trying to pretend that they don't have any awareness of it um we've got the two of swords they think that if they keep going that um wow this is interesting someone is definitely under there's some kind of revenge or manipulation here over a situation this maybe a karmic knows about your connection and is seeing a situation that is you know not have they're not happy about and so they're they're keeping them in a situation maybe they've just got them to sign a contract with them until july because they know that they're going to have to be in it in it you know it, there's something here that if they've been hurt by this person this karmic's about to get revenge here and uh, this is a mess right here it, it's almost gonna uh, it's not gonna allow them to leave it's like they're they're secured in again cancer energy um it's securing them in so that they can't july 7th there could also be news of a new birth and that could be what they're preparing for that's what they're maybe investing in possibly let's have a look so they're having to close out what they want because of this other responsibility um they're blocking what they really want because of this other responsibility or this other situation um they at some point may have wanted to offer a situation an emotional situation um but i think at some point they walked or you walked and maybe they walk thinking that they can get out of this at another point but they've been sucked into it or they're going to walk at another later down the line maybe it depends everyone's situation is different let's have a look they're scared about a loss here they're, they're scared about losing someone they're scared about losing one or both people um and so again someone's wow that just jumped out of my hand just just to fly further across the room awesome the tower is in reverse and it's jumping um they know to get out of this now is going to cause a huge tower moment and so they're not willing to do it but there is a tower moment coming here because they keep investing in something that again i think someone's i think someone's leading them up the garden path i think whatever they've invested in is may not be necessarily true but they're about to get into a situation that they're worried about their, their reputation they're making all of these plans not out of any other reason apart from they're worried about what people think there's no emotional comfort here but there's a towel what's the towel moment about please what is this towel moment A future they're trying to um balance their future out right what is the tower moment please let's ask with the other tarot Four. what is this tower moment definite of an ego 
but what exactly brings the tower what is what does the tower look like wow there's some kind of temptation that's being brought in that is going to create a tap so what is this tower though what is this temptation what is this devil energy so if someone was trying to leave this person let's say this person was trying to leave a karmic they've presented something that is allowed not allowing the person to leave and it will be a t based on temptation devil energy based on that something um there's a decision that's being made here it's a very strong it's i mean to be honest with you it's it's about they're gonna have to make a decision what is the decision please it's commitment it's uh, to be honest with you it feels like someone could be finding out they're pregnant and then they have to propose but I'm half of me is like some people it might be real but some people it might be a massive lie just to get the proposal if I'm totally honest with you so something's not adding up here um, again with the high priest in the reverse and then the world we've got the ten of wands and the six of swords so there's definitely struggle here to kind of understand what is happening again the queen of cups in the reverse very, there's something being manipulated it's not quite mm, not sure about this energy justice it's karmic there's some karmic link to this so if you were led down the garden path if you were deceived or lied to i feel like this is karma mm, kind of hitting someone's backside here someone may have emotionally really invested in this and it's going to be revealed as an illusion i'm going to be real honest with you and it's going to cause pain again this may drag out to july because i keep they're going to end up again they're going to end up they're going to be worried about losing their wish fulfillment which probably is their divine counterpart they're going to be worrying about that but whatever this is that's being woven around them there's there's a third party that's the situation that wasn't closed out and so that this is getting there's a lot of movement here that wasn't resolved things were being kind of the goalposts were being changed or moved it's it, it wasn't um there was this is this is getting complicated basically um what is the, what, let me see what this card is hang on so again it could be that someone is in involved in sort of casual sex or some kind of sex that got them into a situation that now they're having to or maybe there was you know some situation that they weren't protecting themselves um it could be that they are now going to block that or i don't know maybe someone comes back and they or the third party comes back and they say no but there's definitely a third party situation here there's definitely some kind of news or shock that it highlights what's really been going on and the decision has to be made very quickly and again the devil is coming out here over revenge and the sun it's again it feels like children um yeah they're not even making a decision about it it's like they're oh, lord above again very fast moving someone's going to make a real quick decision here about this situation i feel like this male or if it's a male is not going to want to get involved in this so it could be that they turn the the situation down they're worried about their reputation though and their future but there's something about it just doesn't i don't know if i want to invest in whether or not this is i don't know it feels like a lie because the knave of swords has just come out in the reverse why do i feel like this is someone trying to lie about a situation again we've got the magician coming out in the bottom i don't know if this is real i don't know if this is real it just it feels like this is not it, it's yeah clarify this this card please 
So they're going to go within and try and figure out what they're doing here. So again, if it's not pregnancy, it's going to be some kind of revenge that the karmic wants to provide. They, again, their energy feels like they're going to at some point take some space to try and figure out what they're doing. But I think they're going to want to make the effort here and work at this situation because... Hmm... But they, they turn it down or they're debating turn they're debating running yeah look i think this person is gonna um there's some kind of let's have a look there's a new cycle here This is interesting. I don't think they're going to go for it. I, th I think something changes in it, it. Something links to um, into January with this that changes the whole thing. There's something here that's. Um, it's not quite clear cut. It, it, whatever this is, if they're I don't know that. Let's have a look at the outcome. So this this does lead into January. Let's have a look at the outcome for this spread. It's I feel designed, or someone's trying to trap someone. This is awful. Lord. I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't know why you would need to do that, but anyway, I'm trying not to judge the person here. Let's see. Wowzer. This is heavy energy as well. All right, let's see. What is the outcome, please? What is the outcome? What is the outcome, please, for Aquarius up till the 15th? What is the outcome? Wow. I'm telling you, this is going to get dragged out till January. It's like someone is not going to know the truth until January. Until it's too late. It's someone's playing games here. Um... What is the outcome, please, for up to the 15th? It's a masculine that um, I feel wasn't committed. And so this third party has decided to teach them a bit of a lesson. Um, let's see. Yeah, it could be that this actually there is a child that's coming in July. That could also be another thing. Um, which means November it would have been conceived, which means that they're again they're going to find out around this time. Um, let's see, and I th what is this revenge thing, please? So it actually could be real for some, it could be real for some, it's not. Um, this could be with a karmic that they weren't even serious about. And they, they are now going to have to get deadly serious about it. It's like, it could be that this person knew that they weren't being taken seriously. So now they something's happened here. Something has happened. Um, what is the Ace of Swords, please? I think they knew... They knew that this situation was going to end. And so someone's done something a little bit drastic um what is the january card please yeah that it was success assured something about their reputation this is going to get announced in january 
this whole thing's getting announced in January. So if you don't know about it and it doesn't get announced yet, there's, there's going to be a reveal in January. Um, what is the outcome, please? The world and the seven of swords. So what's going to happen with this situation? Is it destined or... Because I feel like people are going to be sat here going, well, tell me the outcome then. What is going to happen, please, with this situation? What is the outcome to this situation in general? Wow. So the emperor is no longer controlling. So this is someone's divine masculine here who is going to go through a loss. Because if they've avoided you because of their fear of a loss of control, they're now going to go through a loss of control. Um, the high priest is reversed, which is talking about basically a lesson that wasn't learned and, and a world card, which basically talks about. Yeah, this is an end of a third party situation and it's done because of this. Yeah, there's a definite end point to something here um, that involves, again, counterparts. But because of this situation, it's like, what is going to happen with this situation, please? The tower. This is going to kick off. What's going to happen with it? So that was what the tower card was for a lot of you, not all of you. So what exactly is going to happen with this tower card? Yeah, there's the, everyone's going to be different. Some of them they know and they haven't made a decision. Some of them they know and they've made a decision and it's going to kick off. And some of them they know they haven't, you know, there's different variables, but we'll have to sort of see if this comes up again in other readings. But again, anything else you can tell us, please, about the situation? Uh oh. So we've got the high Hierophant and the High Priestess. So this is them leveling up. So once they learn from this, this is them now meeting your criteria because they're leveling up. This is going to create a big lesson. Um, it's going to create a very big lesson um, because they're matching yours. It's like their their vibration wasn't matching. Let's see. Their, their energy levels there. They hadn't learned yet. This is what. Yeah, they're going to undergo a loss. They're going to be walking away from a loss here. Okay, guys, this was your reading. I hope that's helped. Thank you for your likes, your shares, and your subscriptions. It means a lot to, to me. Um, yeah, I hope this helps. I, I really hope it helps, and I hope this gets positive resolution here for everyone. All right, guys, keep your fingers crossed. Take care. Bye.